Okay guys, this is Rich again with Ultra Motorsports. Today and we're taking a look at our Austin Healey. It's on display here at the uh, baggage claim at the Fort Wayne International Airport. And we're doing a walk around for a uh, potential buyer. And uh, we're just gonna do kind of a general condition walk around and pick up on a few of the areas that he wanted to see the most. We're looking at fit, finish. I'm gonna try and point out any flaws that there might be on the vehicle. And um, unfortunately we can't start it start the car but um, uh, if he wants to see that we'll get it pulled out of here and started for him at some point in time so uh, first general impression of the vehicle from uh, the driver's side front fender I don't see any chips any nicks um, like we said this is a, um, a Kurt Tanner restoration and uh, you know everybody who knows that name in the Austin Healey world knows that he does do it right uh, the paint is absolutely flawless I don't see any chips or nicks or blemishes anywhere in the paint. Uh, the chrome is in exceptional condition also. Okay. The way I described this car to the um, the way I described this car to the potential buyer was um, you know while a concourse car is too nice to drive, this one is certainly just below a concourse car. Um, not quite too nice to drive, but exceptionally nice and a, and a show winner in any show it would go to. Uh, wire wheels look excellent. Driver's side front fender looks great. I have the wheels turned so we can get a look inside the fender wells and get a look in there. Uh, this car, I believe, was driven here, so you know if there's any water spray or overspray, it's it's uh, there could be some of that here. Inner front. And you can see the cove here, looks great. All the trim, exceptionally tidy. All of this long pieces of uh, stainless trim on the car look great. Fit is excellent. Again, fit, exceptional on the car. All the chrome looks great. Wire wheels look great. Um, let's see if we can see back here. <clears throat> very, very nice. All this stainless looks very good. Back of the car, uh, all of these small, small pieces, um, there, there's no pitting or no uh, corrosion that can be seen in those either. Uh, rear bumper um, is excellent. No dents, no dings, uh, no chrome flaking off. As we look in the um, cargo area of the car, now this is just a battery cover. Um, but if you look at some of the, the, you know, this is one of those cars that just the more you look, you see the the finish of the car. I mean there's nothing, absolutely nothing that was not touched during the restoration of this vehicle. So hammer tools, extra wire wheel, every piece looks like it's brand new and fresh. And again anybody who um, knows the purpose of our walk arounds it's not just to kind of point out everything good about the car, but we're also looking for a flaw, you know, if we can find one in these cars, because we want our customers to be very well informed and aware. This door's open here. <clears throat> okay. Wire wheel looks great. Again, inner wheel well. Exceptionally nice. If, this, if the customer would like this vehicle on a lift, uh, we can get it pulled out of here and put on a lift for him also. Again, fit looks great right here. Fit finish. Uh, you shut this door, you know, it sounds like a brand new car. So all this chrome is excellent with no pits, no pitting whatsoever. Uh, stainless on the wiper arms is excellent. All these window gaskets look excellent. And the windshield is not peppered at all. There are no paint blemishes whatsoever anywhere on the car. This great iconic Healy grill 
uh, is in excellent condition as well. Okay, um, <clears throat> you can see the inners here. It's a little dirt, a little dirt there. Redone. This I don't know if this is a previous repair of some kind, but. If Kurt Tanner did it, you can be assured that it's done right. Hope I don't know. Hope my flashlight isn't messing with it. This is all. These are all painted surfaces, by the way. Painted. This one's painted and clear coated. Uh, these all look like they're just painted and not clear coated. Um, so hopefully it's coming through on the video. Uh, we'll go look under, under the hood here in a second. Let's uh, cruise onto the interior. All of this like um, knocked out, like maybe like a Dynock type. Um, pattern here. I, I would imagine this is exceptionally difficult to uh, recreate on these vehicles. Um, all this looks very very nice. Maybe one very small little dent right here but that's all I see. The interior of this car looks like it's never been sat in. I mean it is truly exceptional. Uh, there's no um, rubbing on any of the bolsters and uh, seat belts look like brand new, look like they've never been fastened. Seat backs look excellent. Cruise around here. Driver's side, all of the, again, all the stainless is in excellent condition. All of this, these pieces on top where you know, that would be abused normally by just normal wear and tear. Look excellent. Uh, this seat bolster is in excellent condition. Again, it looks like this vehicle has really not even been sat in or used. I guess, you know what, if we zoom in very close, you can see this very, very minor rub here. You know, where it looks like maybe just somebody's rear kind of caught that over the years. You can see how really unremarkable it is, but um, that's a close-up of it. Dash and uh, instruments. Chrome is excellent on all of this. I mean, com quite literally flawless on all of this chrome. Very, very nice. Very good condition. Okay, carpet is excellent as well. So uh, let's pop the bonnet. <clears throat> okay. Unfortunately, it's going to take two hands, I think. Sorry folks, uh, engine compartment is excellent. Uh, we can kind of zoom in here and see some of the, um, you know, the um, structural components of the car and see really the quality that went into the restoration. Literally every piece touched on the car. I don't see anything that was taped off or anything that was, that was um, not uh, off the car in the course of the restoration. Okay, um, we can look down here, see all this. Very tidy, excellent condition. Okay, okay, again, folks, 1961 Mark 1, Austin Healey BT7. Ultra Motorsports, Fort Wayne, Indiana. This is a video walk around for a potential buyer and we're gonna get this fired off to him right away.